Check two one two. <laughs> Oof, girl, you go to the gym. You do this. <laughs> I know. Why do they make it so hard? Oh wait. <laughs> you got a knife? Gawk off. Maybe a spoon would have been better. It's cute. Oh, I got it. I'm strong. That's it. Just twist it. No, it wasn't twist at all, but it was just lift. Oh my god, I'm scared. What if there's nothing in there? <laughs> oh no, you're good. Okay. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Guys, this is my friend Daniela. Hi! We're gonna do a little taste test. This company called Move Butter, they reached out to me. They are the supermarket of the future, or so they say. <laughs> they, they're basically an online grocery store, kind of like Brandless. Have you heard of Brandless? Not at all. Oh, I did a video on Brandless. It's actually kind of popular. Has like Damn, I didn't watch it. <laughs> has like 2K, you know? Anyways, um, they have like, the, everything is $3. And it's like mostly snacks and like packaged stuff. But but this is actually like, oh, look. like <laughs> this is actually like real food. Like I think they sell meat and like fruit and like also packaged stuff. It's like a more grocery store than just like snacks but they reached out to me and they said that they would love to send me like vegan snacks i guess they know that i'm vegan so <laughs> i'm not <laughs> but i wanted my friend to be here so we can like try some things together and just there they have stuff for six dollars they have stuff for seven dollars they just have more they have more variety I feel like they their options are way more than brandless but they do have stuff that are three dollars too hmm, they have couscous for three dollars and stuff i don't know if that's like a good price or not because everything is getting so expensive now I've never, I don't shop for food, so I me, shop for food and it's always so expensive. They have jam, ooh. Honey, ooh, honey, butters, salsa, nuts. They have a lot. They have oils, pasta. That's interesting. Wait, wait, wait. Go back to the pasta. Okay. <laughs> Spinach fettuccine. Ooh. They have a lot of stuff. It's not just vegan, but what we have here is vegan snacks. All right. All right. Should I read the you mission statement? Well... Yeah. We're and then just read these, the like bold. Okay. It all started as a joke. We would call it the snack of the future. We're also busy that we would fantasize about basic imaginary block that still had all the qualities we associate with good food. We dreamed that a one inch times one inch block would be the most fundamental unit in your diet. That it would be a physical version of our vision for food. Meaningful, functional, delicious, and accessible to all. We would joke that if your diet is as complex is a complex chemical reaction with thousands of co compounds, then this snack would be a simple atom and it was never meant to be a real product. I'm confused. I was gonna say, I'm not sure I understood that. I'm sorry, this is too much for me. It was just a moonshot idea. Well, today we put man on, uh, today we put a man on the moon. After two years of designing, cooking, testing, we're proud to present the first move butter moon blocks. Um, one, balanced and complete nutrition. Moon blocks are modeled after astronaut diet. Okay. It kind of does look astronomical, oh. like this cylinder stuff. Like it looks like, like something that a space person would take to them on a mission or something. I was thinking of like something that is small and easy slash quick that you could just pop right in your mouth. Mm -hmm. But it has all your like nutritional necessities. Okay. Is real, ingredients. Might be completely wrong. is real ingredients that you can pronounce. It has incredible taste. It's affordable and easy as hell. Moon blocks cost less than four dollars a pack. Uh, ethical and transparent sourcing, and just plain cool. And each flavor is named after a moon in our solar system. Ooh, that's cute. Okay, supermarket of the future. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh damn, this is a lot actually. <laughs> oh, Pluto! So this is Pluto, Pluto one. Um, it's coconut mango pomegranate blocks. I'm here mm. for this. It Pluto. Oh, it tells you about the Pluto. It's um, aka Charon. It's the largest of five known natural satellites of the dwarf planet Pluto. Um, it's a planet, oh. not a moon. They say they said his name after a moon. I think it's. It's a satellite of the dwarf planet. It's a satellite. So a satellite, like another word for moon? Or fake little moon or something? I'm not a scientist. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, mango, co mango coconut blocks. 
Ooh. Mmm. Okay. Are you ready? It's just like coconut. It's like chewing. Ah! <laughs> Our cocoa. What do you think? I think it's like it's simple. Good. I mess with it. Mm -hmm. You got like more coconut. Pumpkin. I feel like I taste mainly mango. Mm -hmm. Like there's like a shot of mango in there. It's good. I feel like I would put this in the refrigerator though because the coconut could maybe go bad. Does coconut go bad? Sometimes I feel like there has been a couple times where my coconut oil would go bad mainly in the mm. summertime. Like you can smell it and you know it's going Four bad. servings per container. Thumb Okay, number two. <laughs> and last. Wait. No, continue. I think that's something else, but I might be. Okay. This one is Mimas. Mimas is is a moon of Saturn discovered in 1789. It's about to be delicious. Um, Hi. It is oatmeal and raisin block. Are eating? They remember the vegan so the company that sent me vegan snacks. So I told you about the it. vegan snack taste. Snack taste. Yes. What's in there? Stuff. <laughs> so oatmeal. Yeah. I'm ready. <laughs> Oh, that's right. I got a big one. Oh my god, I did get a big one. So it's oak granola, brown rice syrup, raisins, brown rice cereal, oak granola, black seed, knock powder, maple syrup. Not gonna lie, I'm let down. Mm, I feel like if I had chocolate, I love chocolate, so I feel like if I had chocolate, it'd be better. I agree. They're super healthy, though. I feel like. I would keep stuff like this in like my gym bag yeah. after the gym or after you like work out or like my gym bag. or like when you're like going on a walk or like going to the beach or something it would be cute to have these snacks with you right no? I feel like I'd give these to a kid because they're not that sweet <laughs> and I trust <laughs> that they won't be jumping kids. off the wall this would be perfect for kids because they're cute and it's like a cute little story and they learn and they learn and then they can, you know, have a, teacher, <laughs> have a natural, you know. I still eat this one. Okay. Oh. Is there another one? No, but. Oh. Ah! You got a coat. Oh. You can do butter. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> so thank you, um, Move Butter, for my two little healthy little vegan snacks and this cute little tote. Um. This is not sponsored. Not at that level yet. Feel free to do it though. In the future <laughs> though. Um, I just wanted to share with you guys this company since I did my brand list video and that did really well. Maybe you guys like, you know, stuff like this. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Keep sending it. I'll keep eating it. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>